Trailblazer, trailblazer, trailblazer again, trailblazer, trailblazer, trailblazer again. Thank you for watching this video. In this channel, you and I will be reviewing different cars and learn at the same time. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider joining us. If you are a subscriber, please click the like button. Thank you. So this is the Phoenix version of Trailblazer from Chevrolet. Let me show you the back. The side looks like that. With a nice like a bushwhacker. Blacked out chrome. There you go. It says Duramax Diesel Trailblazer. 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 Everything is trailblazer. You also have a spoiler with top mount brake light. And even the logo is blacked out. So I wonder what's in store for us for this variant. It's very macho. Nice decal. It says trailblazer again. So let's start from the front. You have chrome accents with halogen lamp, halogen lamp and turn signal and fog lamp uh, the grill with the black out Chevrolet logo and the hood ornament with trailblazer trailblazer again okay let's go here so this one is a so this is an 18 inch alloy wheel from Chevy nice looks very clean and single color so it has a footstep or step board made of hard plastic. That's Trailblazer again. So the side mirror has embedded turn signal light and just the mirror. And this car doesn't have a smart key entry. So there's a physical key uh, oh, insert. Okay, we'll just open it later. So it also looks like that. And the fender, big plastic fender, I think it's special for this. Uh, unit the uh, Phoenix variant and there's the gas cap for the back So the tail lamp has the brake light the fog lamp and the reverse light and the turn signal Also fog lamp and also reverse light You see there's a camera so it has a backup camera, but I don't see the rear sensor Here you have the uh, windshield washer fluid Top mount. It's an LT. Let's get the key and try to get inside. So this is the key to the Trailblazer uh, Phoenix Edition. So you can open and you can also... Okay, when you close it, there is uh, two horns. And when you open it, there's just the light. And it's a flip type of key. Not a smart key and that is it let's open it let's open it and let's go thank you okay. let's go inside so the car is open it says Chevrolet it doesn't have it doesn't say trailblazer okay let's go inside oh this is a test drive unit but it's really smelling good oh oh nice this one when you open the door like a sports car or something you know it goes down and when you close the door it goes up oh it's my first time to see something like that in an SUV so you have the uh, window power window buttons still unsure if they are fully automatic and you have the side mirror adjustment door lock and unlock so everything is good and on uh, let me show you the dashboard There you go, that's how the dashboard looks like. The material is hard plastic and also uh, hard plastic, soft plastic over here. And the handle is like a leather, but I really don't know this material even earlier. So it's like a leather type because you know, they're like stitching. And on the handle you have the Chevy mark, it doesn't say Trailblazer airbag. That's the hands-free control. And the cruise control must be somewhere else or it doesn't have one so the light system is here it's not automatic instrument cluster light level adjustment and headlight leveling adjustment so this car has 
computer control here and left and right and menu button is here and also for the light you can do that and on the right side you have the wipers for the front and the back when we look at the instrument cluster uh, it has chrome accents with the screen in the middle they are all analog type the tachometer and also the speedometer gas cap release is here the hood release is here and there's a speaker here here in the middle you have a screen here maybe uh, six inch or five and the audio system is here and the vents are here the air condition system it's not a digital type uh, some people like it some people don't with chrome accents and this car has also the hazard you have the 12 volt here rear AC button another 12 volt here that's good uh -huh. there's an airbag here soft plastic the glove box it's very good uh, there's something here but I'm really not sure what it is for so there's a cup holder in the middle there are two and in the uh, center console you have the USB port and the aux port you have a physical super hard uh, handbrake the gear lever is here, uh, P, R, N, D with sports mode. Okay, normal uh, room mirror, sunglass holder, and uh, we have mirror over there. I'm not sure if there's a light. And here, I'm also not sure if there's a light, but there's a mirror definitely. And there's a handle here. So this is like a ed limited edition. Uh, there's a sensor part here, but I think this version doesn't have so this is not the top variant Obviously because it doesn't have a 4x4 option Place where you can put your uh, change. So let's go to the back and let's see what's There so the seats are still fabric. You remember guys. This is the Phoenix variant This is how it looks like from the front. Let's go to the second row. So the door panel is just the same. It has the cup holder and power window button and a speaker. So here at the back, you have the 12 volt here as well. And this is how it looks like from the second row. Uh, you have a pouch in each. So we have a cabin light, uh, aircon, vent and also the control for the fan or the blower and we have the armrest with cup holders so it's you can kind of rest your arm uh, somehow like that <laughs> if you don't have your drink then you can do that but if you do like that it's okay and the head adjustment for the head support the handle another vent for the third row another light for the third row which is very nice the space is really huge uh, because there's a, like a sinking area so it's like a waterfall so it goes down and there's more space you can stretch your legs and you can hide the buckles over there and you can also place something here anything because you have your own cup holders on each side it's very very nice Good. So obviously there's a camera over there and for us to open this you can just access this way So you have lights 12 volt you can put a tonneau here There's light this compartment is there something under here? Oh, this is the place where you uh, unlock so that you can lower the spare tire here and it's not the emergency type It's the regular one defogger and there's another light let's close it so guys i don't know if you enjoyed the video i hope you guys enjoyed uh, please give a thumbs up please subscribe if you want more wow first chevy in the channel thank you guys for watching bye bye please do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and notification bell thank you everybody may your dreams come true